Welcome to Let's Talk Business Podcast. I am your host, Lord World Be Free. And we're just so excited to be here this morning where we talk about so much, so many just great opportunities and events that's coming up and coming down the pipe. So let's just get started with introductions and find out who we have here. I have two wonderful people who are here with joining me this morning. And uh, go ahead and let's introduce yourself. My, my friend right here to my left. What is your name and who are you? Good morning. Good morning, Lord. My name is Bobby Holman. I am a new board member for Tri-County Regional Black Chamber of Commerce. And we are super excited to be bringing um, the annual um, plan of work conference here to our area in Lake City. Fantastic. The planning of our first annual, well, not the first annual, just we've been having these conferences for a while. So since we've been having these conferences, and let's talk to the lady who knows even more about the conference. Let me introduce to you the next person we have in our studio host today. Leandria Thompson, and I am the chairman, uh, chairwoman, shall I say, of the board of directors of Tri-County Regional Black Chamber of Commerce. And you're right, this is our 15th annual plan of work conference and we're holding it in our region two which is galveston county because we do serve nine counties in the southern district of the state of texas man that's fantastic to be a part of the tri-counties all these different counties working together to be able to bring in uh, business and monies so that all these people and all these companies can be able to uh, all can cash in because we're talking about business. Let's yes. talk business podcast and we're talking about bringing in money to yes. the tri counties. That's fantastic. Tell us a little bit about more about the conference, the date, and the time of the conference. Uh, Ms. Um, the date is on Friday, November 15th, 2019, and um, we'll be kicking off our conference bright and early at 8 a.m and the conference will go until 3 p.m. It's action-packed. There is so much information um, to be had and to be received at the conference with the conference sessions, uh, it, uh, so much training, and just a really, really uh, valuable uh, conference that we're bringing here to the county. So Ms. Thompson, let me ask you, so who should attend a conference like this? Anybody who is in business or want to be in business and those entrepreneurs who provide business services for people who are in business. I still call them entrepreneurs. They provide services, they're not in business, but they are providing services to people who are in business. So, fantastic, fantastic. Now it says access to more money. And you keep saying business, so we wanna make sure we also uh, um, talk about the SBA, the, the small, small Business Administration. Tell me a little bit how they play a part in uh, being able to put this and piece this whole uh, conference together. Well, Lord, as a Chamber of Commerce and we support and promote uh, business activities, our mission is to acquire and disseminate valuable business information, resources, and tools for small businesses to be able to compete in the world of business and to become economically uh, independent. And we do this not only in as domestic in the city of Houston, in the state of Texas, in the, the uh, whole United States of America, but we also do it internationally, okay? So, um, in, 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 in providing a, in, in achieving, let me say it like that, achieving our mission, we have what we call partners okay. and supporters. Fantastic. Okay? And so those partners and supporters are there to help and to assist small businesses from being small to growing to major businesses that have a lot of impact on our economy, but even small businesses right now, the biggest impact is we create jobs. That's what we need, and that's what we need in our uh, in our neighborhoods and our and our communities. People being able to work, making them feel good about themselves, making them be able to take care of their families and their personal needs, and that's just fantastic, man. I am so excited uh, about this conference and what y'all are bringing to the Houston area. Uh, uh, just give me some of the sessions. What are you, what are you going to be talking about at, at, uh, and teaching at some of these conferences? 
Well, um, Lori, we're going to be having a hub and hub son subcontracting plan training. Um, there will be exhibitors on hand. Um, there will be a session uh, titled Marketing Keys for Small Business Owners. Um, and there's also going to be a, an IRS workshop for small business owners. Um, also included is there's going to be a DBE training for truckers. Um, and uh, also a topic to discover more business opportunities. So what one of the things that really excites me about the conference is it is not just designed for one type of business. It's not just designed for the business owner that's already established or a particular uh, business. Um, it, it's designed for a small business. It's, it's designed for business professionals. It's designed for new entrepreneurs. It's designed for those who want to start a business but they're not really sure about starting a business but when they come to this conference they will leave they they will leave this conference with a whole new outlook it, wow. it's it's going to be life-changing because i went i attended the i attended the conference last year and and it was in uh, or uh beaumont texas and you know it it blew my mind just literally and so when when if, if you commit or you invest in your business by coming to this conference you won't you won't be disappointed i guarantee it and i, I like how you said invest yes. you know because as a business owners you have to understand you're not spending money no, that's right you're investing money right. for your business future exactly. right. and we have to get that mindset right and and our people and when we come into talking about our, our business we're not we're not spending money right. we're investing money and we're exactly. investing in your business future and we can see that your opportunity that you took to invest um, a capital in your business in Beaumont and now look at you now and just tell me a little bit how did that help you uh, become uh, where you are now a little bit it was really an eye-opener for me um, when I attended the hub uh, workshop and I, I sat there because for my business I, I am in retail okay. and so I sat there and I was just like Okay, so where do I fit into all this? And I thought that that was not a place for me no. until until Leandria said, "Whoa, whoa, wait, wait a second. Here, here you go." And so when I was able to see the contracts that were out there that are accessible to me through um, being a hub um, approved vendor, it, it just opened my eyes because there are huge entities that are out there that are looking for us. Wow. That looking wow. for me. You know, it, it's funny. I just had a conversation with a friend of mine who's trying to start a business, and I told him he need to come to the conference. He's trying to do carrier service. And I'm like, you, you, it's, you we're in 2019. You going knocking on doors and, and trying to um, gain access to the person who's going to be making that decision or not? Man, that's so, you know, that's so old fashioned. Right. It's a new way right. to do it. You have to network, you have to come and be a part of where things are happening and, and get into the stream of the business flow so that you can be able to get some of that water splashed on you. Absolutely. So uh, Ms. Ms. Thompson, I see that you have something to add to that as well. Well, what I wanted to add was when we talk about our partners and supporters, a lot of times acronyms, which we use a lot, like we use HUB, these are kind of uh, hidden, the real, what it really is. So hub acronyms kind of they say what what is my normal uh, word for that hit things in plain sight. In plain sight. So right. when we say hub, we're actually talking about an affirmative action type of program that the state of Texas uh, initiates called the or have uh, put in program historically underutilized business. So it's shortened it to hub. You like you have SBA yeah. Small Business Administration. Mm -hmm. DBE is one that was mentioned, which is Disadvantaged Business Enterprise. Mm. So when we're talking business, we are being able to help that business owner understand what they are looking at and what they see when they see these acronyms. Definitely. So our supporters and our partners are, with, are in public markets and private markets. So we have quite a few of the supporters the um, partners that's going to be at the conference who will be able to make the connections for small businesses. So, because we have a, we have a slogan that we say, when the right connections matter, 
you need to connect to the right network. And we do believe that Tri-County Regional Black Chamber of Commerce is a fantastic network for small business owners. We are an inclusive chamber. Okay. So the word black in our chamber okay. only refers to our culture. Okay. In, in, and cu culture meaning maybe being underserved. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay? Definitely, definitely. So we are inclusive. So the, we have, I think we have League City uh, Chamber of Commerce that will be participating. And we also have the, since we, this conference will be in League City, then we have the Mayor of League City who will be there. Uh, the League City Economic Development, as well as SBA, Texas Department of Criminal Justice, Texas Department of Transportation, the uh, State of Texas Hub Program. I also believe we have Health and Human Services Commission, State of Texas. So we have, I think we have like 16 state agencies that will be participating, and that is an opportunity for you to develop relationships with these agencies so that when there is a time that they are looking for something specific and they know that you have it or that you can provide it because let's talk business is about relationships that's it and relationships is the key Absolutely. it's so important that you as a business owner develop the, the relationship but not just relationship the right type look everybody say that the at right. the same time <laughs> the right type right, 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 right. for sure again this is let's talk business podcast this is your host lord world be free and we're just so excited about the tri-county conference that's coming up plan of work annual conference on november the 15th um from 8 a.m to 3 p.m tell me again where is it located it's located at the South Shore. South Shore Harbor. It's located at the South Shore Harbor uh, Resort and Spa in League City, Texas. And they do have a conference center. And it, they can go online and register. We do have um, some, I think maybe maybe four or five exhibit uh, tables that are available. Okay. And um, it, it's, it's, like she said, it's from 8 to 3. Lunch is served. We have the commissioner. Well, you, you get a lunch too. You get a lunch. Oh, man. You get it. a lunch. That's it. That's it. Now, what is the what is the fee? What is the what is the investment? The investment. So what right. is the, the investment? The investment. If you are a member of any chamber, okay, of commerce, okay, it is a fifty-five dollar investment. Any chamber of commerce. Any yes. chamber as long as you of can be able commerce. To show as that long you as you. Uh, a member as long as you can tell us that you're okay. a member of the chamber okay any chamber of commerce but you have to go online there are the chamber of commerce listed okay. if yours is not listed then we ask you to list it okay okay but if you're not a if member. you're not a member of a chamber of commerce it's seventy five dollars okay. which is still a fantastic price member fifty five so you're, you're, the okay. difference is you're going to want to be a member. Hurry up. <laughs> hurry up now. If you're listening to the sound of my voice, hurry up today. Go online and become a member of your local chamber of commerce. It's still, it, regardless if you, uh, because I know you're going to come to this conference, but regardless, you still need to become a member. Would you agree, Ms. Thompson, that you still want to be become a member of your local chamber of you commerce? Should, you should become a member because the chamber of commerce is there to support the small business or any business, even your your major businesses belong to chambers of commerce. Okay. 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 Um, and I just wanted to add, at least I did think I wanted to add. <laughs> you know, you, when you get this age, you can have a little moment there. Uh, no, nah, it's all good, it's all good. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you one thing that I'm so glad that you broke down those acronyms. Mm -hmm. You know, because we get in this um, uh, habit of DBA and SBA and right. HBE and all that there. and you know people listening might not know exactly, exactly what those acronyms are so I thank you so much for you breaking those down because I'm talking and one of them I had no clue okay <laughs> okay, okay. On what the hub was okay. she said hub and I'm a green hub and we all up in this hub <laughs> you know but uh we no all up idea. in this hub <laughs> <laughs> yeah. no idea what hub meant so I'm, I'm so thankful well, for your wisdom so that, and, and th that you realized that yeah and you we saw it, that. so we jumped on that well, see, oh, go ahead go ahead part of the part of our let's talk business podcast is to educate our yes. small businesses the chamber has three objectives which is what you're going to be able to see at our annual conference, and that is business, 
development, okay. business education, okay. and business advocacy. Great. So we right. advocate for small business. This is what I was going to say. Chambers of Commerce should be advocates for small business to help you move from one location, or at least let's say concept, to where you're actually operating a business and it's successful. So the purpose for our Let's Talk Business podcast is to bring information to where a business owner or a would-be business owner a wannabe business owner will be able to assimilate that information and actually feel that, that when they step out, they're going to step out on the right foot and they're going to keep going. All right. Well, fantastic. You should plan to be at the Plan of Work Annual Conference on November the 15th, 2019. We're going to get ready to take a short break, but I want to just, we again, emphasize Plan of Work Annual Conference, the Tri-Counties Black Chamber of Commerce is having this event. You should be there. I'm going to be there because I got like five businesses in my head and two on paper. So I need to figure out how to make all these work. So that's November 15th from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Lunch will be served. And the access for more money to you at the South Shore Harbor Resort and Conference. Write this down. Stop right now. Get a pen. Get a pencil. Write this down. The South Shore Harbor Resort and Conference, 2500 South Shore Boulevard in League City, Texas, 77573. Ms. Thompson, what phone number are we giving out today? So those who need more information, they, before we take this break, what's the phone number we need to pass out? Phone number is 832-875-3977. However... Mr. Be Free? Yes. Did I say that right? You said it right. Lord, world be free. <laughs> oh, Lord, world be free. Right. Be, world free is right. okay. be free. Be free. Be free. Be free. Be free. Yeah. World be free. All right. Yeah. Lord, world be free. That's it. They can also go to our website. The short version of our website is www.t and then c b c c dot o r g. The T stands for try, the C for county, B for black. C for Chamber, C for Commerce. So that's www.tcbcc.org. Click on Annual uh, Plan of Work Conference, and they'll have all the information they need. Man, well, fantastic. You heard it. You got the information. Make sure you start making plans to be there. The Plan of Work Annual Conference, November 15, 2019, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m., South Shore Harbor Resort Conference. Let's take a quick break. Let's Talk Business Podcast. Again, I'm your host, Lloyd. World Be Free. And we have some more exciting guests here who will be joining us. And let's just go uh, jump right in and let them introduce yourself. Go ahead, ma'am. Yes, sir. My name is Nicole Curette, and I am a board member with Tri-County Regional Black Chamber of Commerce. Fantastic. And you, sir? Yes, my name is Hugh Gardner. I'm another board member with Tri-County Regional Black Chamber of Commerce. Okay, fantastic. Tell me, how long have you been uh, with the Tri-County? I have been with Tri-County since 2016. Okay, and how did you become, how did you learn about Tri-County? Well, um, actually one of my friends uh, was a member already and I was telling him that I wanted to become a, um, get one of these uh, women business certifications, okay. but it was through another organization, but I paid my money and I had never heard from the people and he was like, oh no, you need to get your money back and I can introduce you to Miss Beyondry. I was like, who is that? So he said, 
said, you know, he told me about Trials County Regional Black Chamber of Commerce, and um, he called her on the phone right then and there. She picked up, we set up an appointment, and it's all history after that. Don't you love it about a person who is so busy but not so busy like Miss Thompson? She will pick up the phone. I don't care what time of day you call her, what she has going on. She can be in Brazil or, you know, she travels a lot, so yes. you have to know. But she'll pick up when she's out of county, out of country, wherever she is, she'll pick up that phone and make sure she's taking care of business for sure. You, Hugh, tell me a little bit about uh, how did you become a part of Tri-County and learn about it as well. Man, uh, one of my friends from high school, his sister, uh, she's a board member as well, uh, has been a member, uh, I want to say for about four or five years, and uh, he just told me about the chamber. Uh, eventually, I just went and asked her about it, and she was like, yeah, this, you know, this the chamber can help you do this, this, and that, and uh, eventually I joined up, and, and, and I'm here, I'm a board member now, so uh, I got this podcast, uh, this is a nice setup, y'all doing a good job, and I just want to say, uh, Leandre and Bobby did a great job uh, for the first section of this podcast, we are freestyling, in case y'all didn't know, this is, <laughs> we are definitely going on the fly right now, and so I think we're doing a good job, I just want to say that. Oh yeah, fantastic, we also thank those who are listening in. On the broadcast, we've been receiving phone calls and things of that sort. But next week, next week, we'll actually have the uh, phone lines open and available for you to call in. But today, we want to definitely talk more about the let's, I mean, the plan of work. Man, the plan of work annual conference, November 15, 2019, from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. is at the South Shore Harbor Resort and Conference Center, 2500 South Shore Boulevard, League City, Texas. 77573. Man, it's just going to be a lot to offer there, a lot of opportunities for you as a small business person to come out. And I know we say we're the Black Ch Chamber of Commerce, Tri City, but it's open to anyone and everyone. We don't want to uh, run into one, anyone away by saying Black Chamber of Commerce, but like Ms. Thompson said on the, on the prior uh, opportunity, she was saying that it was just that's the way it was labeled because uh, some of us was disfranchised at the time. Yeah. How's it helped you, <clears throat> Hugh, being a member? Man, I've just learned a lot about business. Uh, I don't even know where to start. Just starting off with the hub certification. Uh, a lot of people just don't understand what it is and how it actually can help you. I was on the phone uh, this morning with my friends and uh, he was asking, uh, he, he was under the impression that a city, any city organization can just do business with just any business and go, hey, I want to do business with you and it's not bid it out. So I was like, yeah, that's, that's, that's completely the opposite way of thinking about it. You know, you have to put in, a, a, a government organization has to bid out any contracting opportunity. So if you have a hub certification, that can definitely assist you with getting a business contract with the city. So, if, and that's just a government sector, you know, so private sector, definitely, if, if, if you own a business, I'm a business, and we want to do business with each other, and we want to write a contract, then we can do that, and uh, there's no reason really to have a hub certification, but the hub certification will definitely uh, just assist you with getting like a government contract, so that's one thing I learned. Uh, you know, that's fantastic. I mean, it's, it's, it's a lot to think about and, and to explain. We just sit here and talk about it for a long time, but you know, I just, I just wanted to briefly explain that again, but that's the first thing I learned, and it's been beneficial for me just to just to know that information how business is done. Great, fantastic. Now, Nicole, it, will this be your first conference, or have you already attended the conference in the past? Yes, sir. I've attended many conferences in the past. Um, but they are very informative. Um, you will get a lot of information. Um, I've been a business owner since 2008. Okay. But even though I've been a business owner, I still didn't know everything about business. Definitely. Um, most definitely one of the great things about being a part of the chamber, you can attend several different, um, several different um, uh, workshops. If someone has been in business for a while or someone's thinking about starting a business, um, coming to the workshop will take you from step A to Z. Okay, um, well, everything. Fantastic. fantastic. So which, which workshop you found that just helped you? I, I mean, I know it's going to be a lot of different workshops. I, 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 I've heard and seen and read all the different ones. But just, just think about what one that was, you know, that just kind of did it for you to say, wow. I'm so glad I went to that workshop and learned that information. Yes, sir. Um, we just did our second um, business smart course, business smart crash course. Okay. Um, we did it in Region 2, which is Galveston. And um, it, it was a 
packed house. Okay. And it was very, very informative. Um, the whole, every Saturday in September, um, we all met and it was just filled with a lot of information that anyone will need um, to start their business, either if they're new in it or established. Okay. Uh, any particular keynote speakers that uh, come to mind that you're excited about maybe seeing again and or knowing that that's going to be there? Say, oh, because I've been to conference before, and you know, you kind of look and say, hmm. Well, let me see who's who's speaking. I don't know if I want to even go because I don't like that. <laughs> or I, I want, yeah, I, I want to know who's speaking. Who are some of the keynote speakers? You, if, if, either one of you, who have seen you have seen and is excited about being at that conference so you can see them again. One of the people that are going to be speaking that I'm going to be excited to see is Mr. Michael Bryant. Oh, wow. He um he is uh, with. Texas Department of Transportation okay and I went to one of the um, conferences and he spoke and um, he just had a wealth of uh, information and knowledge and he just got promoted so um, Okay. And he he's going to speak at our conference. He has a lot of knowledge to okay. speak on in regards to um, uh, Department of Transportation and uh, trucking and a lot of different things. And and that's why I like about this conference. It's just not focused on just one entity of business. Uh, like the, the 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 speakers earlier, they were saying it doesn't matter which type of business you're coming into. It ain't just for truck drivers. Or it ain't just for construction workers or, or just for medical people. If you are in business and you're small or large, independent, and you want to grow or you want to just sharpen some things out, man, I highly suggest that you come to the Plan of Work Conference, November the 15th, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m., at the South Shore Harbor Resort. You, you you need to be there. You definitely need to be there. Get the information, find out, call us, do what you can. You can be there by boat, train, automobile, car, whatever you need to do. Uber, get the Uber. Uber yourself, get yourself, get yourself there. And I know you, you're you gonna be there, right, Hugh? Oh, absolutely, I, I will definitely be there. Actually, me and Nikki were actually contacting several of the members of the chamber uh, to, to inform them again that we're going to be having this conference on November 15th. So there was an email sent out. Uh, we got the list of all the chamber members. Uh, we made phone calls uh, and sent out emails. So to those people that I call personally and to the people who Nikki called and sent emails out to, these are the people who you're, you, you're interacting with. Uh, you know, I, I definitely made clear that I would like to meet all the other chamber members just because I've been in the chamber since April, I want to say. Yeah, April April of this year. So okay. I'm about six months, I guess. I'm going to have my okay. day off right now. But, uh, <laughs> no problem. But I no just, problem. you know, it's obviously, you know, I want to just meet more people in the chamber. You know, just yeah. from here for yeah. a shorter amount of time. And uh, I express that. So, you know, yeah, y'all come to the, to the conference and come shake my hand. Come shake your hands. Come meet Miss Leandria. Yeah. And, uh, we want to meet y'all. The board members are doing that work. They're reaching out to you guys. Yeah. They're trying to get you to come because it's not just for them. It's also for you so you can learn. You can get the information. You get the tools you need so that you can be able to continue to talk business. Again, we're at the Let's Talk Business Podcast. I'm your host, Lord World Be Free. We're talking to Nikki and Hugh, the, who are board members of the Tri-County Black Chamber of Commerce. And it's just having a great time this morning as we continue to share more and more information about the Plan of Work Conference, the annual conference that's coming up November the 15th. 2019. You must be there. You got to be. Don't, how we say it, don't, what, meet me there, but be beat me there. there. <laughs> sure. You want to you beat it there? The U.S. Small Business Administration, the SBA, will be there. They have uh, some information that they want to share with all the small businesses um, that's going to be there so that they can be able to just make your opportunity better in, in, in your business and things of that sort. Yeah, and just just to, to talk about the SBA, they're going to be they're going to be um, lenders there. You'll be able to actually sit down and talk to a lender, uh, a person who works for a bank that can give you an SBA loan. So, okay, fantastic. Uh, that, that, that's wonderful. I and mean, we need you know we need money. Money, you got to have some money. You're going to be in business. You can't be in business broke. <laughs> you gotta have some money, some type of startup capital to be able to make some things. You need some supplies, or you need some products. You need what it's gonna take to be able to get your business out there. You need some marketing. 
tools. You need all of that. Speaking of marketing, we have um, my man Hugh has on some apparel of his own. Tell us a little oh, yes. bit about what you what you're wearing there, guys. Yes, I, I do have some of my apparel on today. Uh, I have my uh, Texas hoodie on. I do own a business called Our Towns of Texas. You represent your side of Texas. Uh, whichever side of Texas you're from, Houston, Dallas, Austin, we have about 365 designs on the website. Okay. Know? So we have Mo City, Missouri City, I'm sorry. <laughs> Missouri City, Pearland, Katy, Humble, all that's online. And I also have a other clothing line called the History 239. We celebrate African and African American history through our apparel. So okay. uh, this hat that I have on now is a, a Paris Street. It was a black, it was, I'm sorry, it, it was a Black Wall Street in uh, Durham, North Carolina. So okay. uh, it was the uh, highest capita, highest per capita income back in about the nineteen twenties, around that uh, time frame. Fantastic. So uh, we just that's, that's what we do uh, with the clothing line. So All right. So we're not only we able to learn about how to make some money, also can learn some history, Absolutely. history of African Americans or Blacks or, or who have um, made some 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 definitely history in producing monies and business and things of that sort. That's well, it, fantastic. It, yeah, yes. Yes. Just history in general our history you know for, for the culture so yes absolutely. and Nicole just briefly a little bit about uh, how the, um, the 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 workshops have helped you but your business in, in particular what what type of business do you have yes sir I am a real estate broker and I'm also an insurance agent okay and, and I'm glad you said that because uh, I'd like to expound, expound on the business smart uh, crash course um, you spoke about the lenders um, doing that course um, we knew that we would be meeting up with lenders. It was a matchmaking um, uh, segment, but also in the course, it teaches us how to write a business plan, how to go through the, all the steps of writing a business plan. A lot of times people write business plans as like 300, 400 pages long, and that's really not what you need. Oh, wow. And so wow. we found that out in the course. Okay. That was a very important. Um, but um, So why they want to, why, I'm, I'm going to interrupt you. Mm -hmm. Keep your thought. Yes, sir. Why is it not good to write, you know, because I would think the bigger the business plan and all of these pages and words and, you know, I got flow charts and everything, I'm, I can impress the lender. Mm -hmm. Why is it not important to the do that? The lender's not really trying to look through all that paperwork <laughs> to see what you want. <laughs> they basically want to know what does your business do? How will you be able to uh, employ others and um, make money and uh, be paid along? Just the facts. Yes, just they the facts. Just the facts. Stick to that. Quick facts. Quick facts. Yes. And just to talk about the class a little bit more, it is a fast track course. Uh, we meet, at what we, it's three weekends, four weekends. Mm -hmm four weekends and uh, I took the course as well and it's about you're sitting in the class uh, on a Saturday from about 8 to 3 learning about how to write a business plan so that's the investment that you need to do for yourself and for your business uh, I have people calling me up all the time well how do you, how do you write a business plan this and that you know I, I can help you but it's, it's it's intense okay you need to get your mind correct to understand your business and how much money you need for your business and I like what Nicole was saying it's a matchmaking kind of like when you go on that you know that dating service and and things of that yeah. sort and you're trying to find the right lender with the right business person and is it yes, <laughs> I know the right I'm, fit I'm, for the, the right the fit. right fit the right you know what I'm saying <laughs> is it is it like, yeah I'm being I'm being funny but is it like you 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 sitting at the table and it's like five minutes ding then you move to the next table I love you you like me no ding you move around yeah we can work that sign the check let's go type yeah. of is it something like that or it, how does it work it will be something like that that is why you have to know your business uh, the ins and outs of your business and what it, the, uh, the amount of money that you're going to need for your business to help it start up or to expand. You need to know that. And you can't get in front of these lenders like you don't know what you want. Because Definitely. why are they going to give you some of their money if you don't know what you want? Definitely. So that four-week class for those Saturdays, that's going to help you understand what you want. Because sometimes people go in business, they're not sure what it is they want. Yeah. They have, you know, these big pie-in-the-sky dreams but sometimes it takes coming to a conference like this, getting a training to understand, okay, that might be 10 years down the line. How are you going to make rent today? You know what I'm yes. saying? How are you going to do business today? How are you going to be able to make a profit from whatever it is money you have or be able to get loan to you? Provide that product or service to the customers and you make a profit this month or the next three months. Is that, is that pretty much what the training is about at these conferences? Yes, sir. Well, fantastic. Well, we, like you said, you keep hearing why you need to be there. It's important. Who need to attend you? Who need to attend 
this conference. And if you think you, you have a business that you want to start, if you know that you have a business that you want to start, if you are already in business and you're looking to expand, if you are you just got a business loan from, from, from a, a family member and you don't know what you want to do with the money, uh, just if, if you're already in business, you know, if you want to, if anybody who wants to do business, I would definitely recommend coming to the conference <clears throat> because there's just going to be a lot of uh, good information. This is going to be my first conference, actually, so I'm just oh. excited to Fantastic. come. And uh, when Bobby said that, you know, it, it's, it's life changing, I'm looking to have. <laughs> I've been in the chamber for about six months, and you know, it, my life has changed from it. And and if the conference, if one day conference for eight hours changed somebody's life, I can. Only, I'm I'm excited to go. You know, so like that's said, fantastic. And I like your, your your humble spirit. You understand the humility of hey, you hear what Miss Bobby was saying. You understand what Miss Nikki is telling you. Miss Nicole is telling you. You willing to humble yourself and say, hey, I know how to make shirts. I know how to do what I'm doing. But maybe there's still some things I can learn Absolutely. and make my business and make this me who I am yeah. a better person. Again, this is the Let's Talk Business podcast. I'm your host, Lord. We'll be free and we're definitely promoting the Plan of Work Annual Conference, November the 15th, 2019, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Where? At the South Shore Harbor Resort and Conference Center. You won't, you don't want to miss it. I'm telling you, if you miss it, it's going to be an, uh, man, it might mess you up. You might not be in business in 2020. We want you to still be in business. 2020 is around the corner. Make sure you at the South Shore Harbor Conference Center and Resort, 2500 South Shore Boulevard, League City, Texas, 77573. You want to be there, get this information, learn, network, be a part of what's going on in these counties, in the tri-counties. Things are moving, things are shaking, and you're going to be left behind, like yeah. the movie. You're going to be left behind in 2019, and we're all going to be in 2020, getting our business on, networking, moving, and making money happen. Right, Nicole? Yes, sir. Fantastic. So we want to just definitely make sure we give you this phone number. We want to make sure we give you all the information you need to know. Again, SBA, Small Business Association, will be there. You know what? I also want to talk about, tell me a little bit, uh, Nicole, some of the sponsors who will be there as well. Let's let's talk about some of those sponsors. Uh, tell me who are some of the sponsors that's going to be there. Yes, sir. Um, a lot of the sponsors are going to be, um, uh, TxDOT will be a sponsor. So will um, uh, University of Texas, um, okay. HEB. Man, different man. different vendors. Okay, yeah, I see Southwest uh, Southwest, Southwest Airlines. Airlines. Yes, sir. Um, you know, I like to get away. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I like to get away, so no. I might need to go there and see what they're talking about. <laughs> All these wonderful people, man. It's just it's just gonna be. It's more than we have time to even talk about. That's more. We don't have enough time to get it all in. But you want to be at this conference plan of of work. You got to work your plan. A lot of times, people just don't prepare themselves. Yes. Preparation. I've heard success is when preparation and opportunity meets. And a lot of times, we just have this opportunity. Doors may open, but if you ain't prepared to walk in, man, them doors will close on you real fast. So, hey, make sure you're there. Next week, you can get more information about the plan of work. Uh, uh, we're talking about less talk business. This is the less talk business podcast bringing in money you'll get more information next week i'm so just excited about uh what we have coming up the, the let's talk business podcast again your your host lord world be free and we're going to go ahead and take a break thank you so much for tuning in today are you having child support issues are you going through a divorce are you going through a custody battle i know that your family children and property are very important to you and having to navigate through the legal system is probably one of the most difficult experiences you will have to encounter in your lifetime. Please call the Jones Law Firm at 713-222-0196. The Jones Law Firm is committed to helping you in your time of need. Call 713-222-0196 to schedule a consultation today. All right, and welcome back to the Let's Talk Business Podcast. Your host again is Lloyd. World Be Free. We're talking about the Plan of Work Conference, the annual conference that you do not want to miss. November the 15th, 2019, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Lunch will be served. That's the most important part. 
<laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Make sure you eat. Because, you know, you can't talk business on an empty stomach, man. But most people go to lunch. You know, like, well, let's go to lunch, Bob, and talk about, you know, this million-dollar contract. <laughs> yes, so we're going to have some lunch there because it's going to be so much information that your brain going to just get hungry. So we're going to have lunch there, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m., the plan of work, work annual conference, November the 15th at the South Shore Harbor Resort and Conference Center, 2500 South Shore Boulevard, uh, League City, Texas, 77573. You do not want to miss it. Again, I'm just so thankful for the host, uh, being a host today. Um, uh, thank Tri-County for allowing me to come in and just, just talk about the Let Talk, Let's Talk Business podcast. Again, we want to thank Ms. Leandra Thompson, Ms. Bobby Holland, Holman, 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 I'm sorry. Holman, Mr. Tommy, oh, Bobby, Holman, Holman, let's get it right, let's get it right, Mr. Guest, host, let's get it right, Bobby Holman, Nicole Corrette, Corrette, that I, I knew I was going to, I knew I was going to have struggle with that one, I should have been easy with Holman, but Corrette is a little, Miss Nicole Corrette and Hugh Gardner, did I get that right? Yes. All right, fantastic, again, look, at we already got phone calls coming in, that's how, Man, so many people in Houston are so excited about this conference that we can't even stop the phones from ringing. They want to know right now, how do they get signed up? How do they pay? It's, it's, the day is November 1st. November 1st. The day is days. November 1st. Yeah, they got 14 days. Is there a deadline to the conference or, or are we just going to let them come the day of if you got your money? If you are a member of any chamber of commerce, if you're a member of any chamber of commerce, it's $55. If you're not a member of ch any Chamber of Commerce, it's $75. But that's a $75 investment to yes. you. Yes. So I would suggest become a member. But if you don't have time to become a member, come to the conference anyway. Plan of Work Conference, November 15, 2019, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. again at the South Shore Harbor Resort and Conference Center, yes. 2500 South Shore Harbor Boulevard, League City, Texas, 77. Five seven three. I've been your host for the Let's Talk Business Podcast. I am Lloyd. World be free. We'll tune in next week, same time.